and you're not Badmos TV entertainment without bound. First comedy show for 2020, and we're expecting so much as the atmosphere here is actually very, very great like a hundred percent. And the people here they're not bad at all because your favorite comedians are all out to support their own boy, Josh Too Funny. And it costs this one all of me, you know, they are different sides to Josh, right? And we're here to check out every single one of them and maybe a little more surprises. Welcome to Nella Badmas TV, and yes, this is going to be an amazing night talking about comedy in its purest form. My name is Elisha Moyasarulu and trust us to bring you everything happening at the first comedy show of the year all about Just Too Funny and he called it All of Me. Stay right here. An all time favorites. My favorite comedian and trust me I love his acting as well man with the swag man with the most how are you doing Abola? I'm good I'm good how are you doing very well it's good to have you come out thank you very much and yes you're out for Josh Too Funny yeah. why did you choose to come out for it because Josh Too Funny we've been in this for a long time together you know some of us aside just stand-up comedy we try to do other forms of comedy you know for some of us aside stand-up comedy for someone like me, I went into media and of course um, the screens to, to do acting, you know. Josh Tufani took it to social media and, the, and he's been doing very well, you know, on social media. So I'm here to support creativity, you know, because for Josh Tufani, he's, cre he's very creative. I mean, he's extremely creative. And for someone like me who is a creative myself, and when I see other creative, I enjoy it, you know. And so I'm here to support him, uh, to support his creativity, to, watch, to come and sit and just watch to watch him, you know, play through all of that. I know he's been putting in a lot of work, you know. So I won't come see Namika. I was Namika. I come, you know, then applaud. You understand? I say, man, guy, you kill him, you kill him, you kill him. Are you performing tonight? No, I'm not performing. I like to they come, come sit down. You know, so most of the time we are performing. We are always so sometimes just come sit down. Maybe they perform, and give you. All right, guys. Uh, my name is Ogbolo. Now, Sabi me well. Some of you know me as James on Jennifer's Diary. Keep watching, and you'll have bad most TV. Don't touch that dial. All right. Uh. And uh, you know one thing I always like about you every time is your hair. <laughs> you never sleep, you just stand always. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm doing good, I'm doing good. It's good to have you come out. Yeah. But Josh, how does it feel coming to support him? Yeah, George is our brother and uh, Josh rather fights with George. George is our brother and uh, he's been doing uh, amazingly well, so we just have to support him. Okay. Apart from the fact that you woke up this morning and you said, okay, today in our Josh show, what other thing excited you about coming out tonight? Well, uh, life generally. <laughs> I'm excited. I'm alive always. So, but I was super excited that Josh was actually doing this today, and I promised myself I was going to be here to support him because he's a brother. You know, I've known Josh from way back, even before he transformed from his old self to become Josh too funny. You know, and uh, I'm in love with all these characters, everything that he's been doing. And uh, most people doesn't know Josh is an amazing comedian. He's a fantastic comedian, one of the funniest I know. The funny dude, and we can only support such persons. All right, now I know that there's been a lot of change with uh, online sensation. Now we're having them not just online comedians like they call them, but come up on stage to give us stellar performances. What do you think about that? Well, uh, the thing is, there are a lot of comedians, online comedians rather, that are not stand up comedians that can never do stand up comedy. But for someone like Josh, Josh is a madman. He has been a comedian before this online thing came. You know, he's been a comedian. And uh, the first time I saw Josh was with uh, Kofi Daguru, you know, where we did something together. Kofi is like a big boss to all of us. You know, he brought us together. We did something. And that's how we became friends till date. So for me, Josh has been a comedian, a proper stand up comedian before he transformed into this online uh, uh, stuff. So uh, he does it effortlessly because. Does his 
that was his A game, that was his first love before this online thing. The online thing is just like a means of survival to keep to be relevant, you know? Yeah, that's it. Yeah, what's up, my people? It's your boy, Elvis Poku. And I keep watching Auntie and you'll have Badmos TV. <laughs> I did Auntie, sorry. It's good to have a brother out here, one of the finest comedians, Chinese comedian in Nigeria, Ibrahim. I'm feeling, I'm, I don't know. Okay, don't worry, we'll talk about that later. No, greet my people in Chinese. Mm. What does that even mean, though? Don't worry, me and my people, they understand. <laughs> it's good to see you and it's good to have you come out. How does it feel coming out for John? Uh, like, I, I'm so happy that I'm here today because um, it means small like this. I wouldn't have made it, but I'm, th I'm thanking God that I'm here today because Josh Funny is just like a brother to me. So we're here to support, we're here to give our best. Are you performing tonight? Yes, I should be. I should be. I should be. <laughs> so you'll be watching Chinese comedy tonight? <laughs> yeah. The best of it, the yeah. poorest, as in purest of it, uh, happening tonight uh, on stage, uh, first time in 2020, uh, for Just Too Funny. Just Too Funny. <laughs> All of me. <laughs> so let us go there. If you were to describe Josh in one word, what would it be? Funny. Another one? Very funny. I say one word, don't use to, okay. don't feel. I don't know that word to the one word, sorry. <laughs> All right then. So apart from yourself, apart from Josh, what other comedian are you looking forward to perform tonight? To perform tonight? Ah. Wait to, wait to. There are many, so I'm looking for, you just said one, right? If Tawe is performing, I'll be happy. You just had to because family something. But she says, "I'll cut the hair because she ain't about much TV." She don't talk so ah. She so go the hair see. I want to sell all. Boy, how are you doing? I'm very well, and you? I'm very well too, and it's good to have you come out. I mean, you don't, I don't see you come out often, so yeah. If it's not important, I'm not out. If it's good, I come to support. So Josh must be very lucky. No, he's not lucky. He's a brother. He's a friend. He's, he's a colleague. He's my senior colleague, so I came to, I came to support him. Um, he's not lucky. He's a good chap. Um, from I got to know him through Kofi. Um, then from there, he started coming to my comedy club, you know, doing stand up. So now that he's now plenty in one, <laughs> because there is all of him. So I don't know the one that I know anymore. But I just say, okay, out of everybody that I will see, I will know that this one is Josh. This one is my affiliation. This one is. Uh, mistake this one you know i know all right so i'm going to ask you this question based on the fact that you've been here for a very long time you've watched the comedy industry evolve how do you feel to, to watch this young people this young champ you know coming from being called social media comedian to stand-up comedian do you feel like there's a disparity or there is a gap in between no, no, don't, don't let me sit up oh. Josh is not a social media comedian. No. He's a stand-up comedian. We have so many social media comedians out here today. And I, I, I will mention names. Arole started as a stand-up and he still does stand-up. It's just a few. The problem now is if you're funny, you're funny. Don't overdo. Don't overstretch. If, you're, if your strength is on... You people call it skit making. I mean, it's something that can develop to sitcom. That's what you call sitcom. Sitcom is like flatmates. So if your strength is in um, reading scripts and acting it out and making it funny, don't deceive yourself that you're a stand-up. It's a 
it's two different ball games. But it is possible for you to be able to do all. But if you know you are going to be stealing our joke to do skits, we are we know you guys. We are we know you people, we are watching you. But it's not yet time to talk. Because some of our jokes have been um, acted out as skits without giving credit to the original now. So that's plagiarism. So I mean, but if you can do it, why not? <laughs> This guy is big. We don't have 2 million comedians in Nigeria. We are over 200 million people. So there's space for everybody. It's not crowded. Just be unique. Don't steal. Be original. I mean, you have the... Words from Diagba or Ragba. That's what it's called. But looking at it now, tonight I'm sure you've come to have fun. Who are you looking forward to perform apart from Josh? Josh. <laughs> uh, but, uh, you just come in there. Josh, Josh. I mean, it's a show. Uh, we will grow to a point whereby once you see a poster, once you see a billboard, you know it's that person you're going to watch. So it's Josh. I, I don't want to say any other. Josh. I, 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 I remain this except the finest Mr. Handsome Comedian in Nigeria, or Mobaba number one, and you're watching any other bad must TV. To buy for all constitution, you should do To buy be a five. Don't touch that. Uh, keep watching any other TV. Fine boy, say so. Fine. I feel great. I feel fantastic. I feel like now people can actually see more than what they see on IG. He's way more than that. Like that, this guy is he's super duper crazy, super duper doesn't have sense, super duper. Like all the bad bad things, but in a very good way. That's what he is. Right. I like that he said he doesn't have sense. Someone has called him Momo earlier. So yes, Josh, see their faces. <laughs> it wasn't me. It wasn't me. You know. It wasn't me, Shaggy. All right, Liz, you talked about IG earlier. That makes it very interesting because before now, we hear things like Instagram comedian, stage comedian. Do you think there's a difference? First of all, comedy is comedy. And um, the same way we we'll say music is music. But their preferences are different. Their audience are different. Some of the things you see on IG cannot be, cannot be, cannot be brought to reality, because, like, you can't have just that person on stage to do what he did. It shouldn't make complete sense because after three minutes you are still waiting for more, and then there is nothing more you're getting, and then you feel like, oh, this person is not funny. Or he's funny. It's just that his validity period has expired. But for stage comedy, you prepare yourself for 10 minutes, you prepare yourself for 15 minutes. And you can't be having that on IG when you all you spend 5 minutes max. After 5 minutes, people are tired of the video already, so... So you feel like it's just the platform that differs? Um, I wouldn't say it's the platform, because the same people who laugh on IG, they will laugh when you see on stage, when you do your thing. Do you understand? It's just like, I think it's a genre of comedy, let me put it that way. Let me put it I might, I might want to buy that. <laughs> I might want to take that. Are you performing tonight? Oh no, I came to enjoy myself. I came to be entertained. Entertained so apart from Josh. Who else are you looking forward to entertain you? Oh, all of them on the bills are my boys, though. Don't make me go for it on you right now. Like from Kenny Black. All of them, they are my people. So I came here to enjoy myself. Yeah. I'm proud. I'm proud. Like I'm, I'm just a proud brother. Duh. It's one of the most talented people in the industry. Different characters. Like you can actually put that in the class of Martin Lawrence, Eddie Murphy. People that have played different characters. Like they, like man, that's crazy. It's crazy. Is that good? So describe him in one word. Crazy. <laughs> Straight up. No thinking about it. Are you performing tonight? I should. Yeah. So what should we expect? Me, I'm not crazy. I just talk. I'm a normal man being. I'm not like some people. You know? At least I have sense. Yeah, unlike some people. Unlike some people. 
Josh, are you listening? You understand what I'm saying? <laughs> Anyways, it's good to have you come out and we hope that you have fun and also give us 100% yeah, because my eyes are on you. Should we expect a show from you this year? Yeah, we should. Fingers crossed. Tito Teller. Fingers crossed. You heard it from here. What up, what up, beautiful people? They call me S. LK, aka Omar because you're not the bastard. Look at you. Guess where we are at? I'm at Enola Badmos TV. Keep it locked. Don't touch that dial, ladies and gentlemen. Enola Badmos TV. SLK says so. Look at you. Wrinkle, wrinkle, forever, forever, forever. <laughs> Perfect introduction for forever, forever. How are you doing? Very well, thank you. It's good to have you come out. Just so funny, no shall let you. What we go do now? We say, we say to the more come out. If we not come out now, the world will go end. Uh -huh. But the world never end now. So don't they? Yeah. So we come out to say we not come out now. The world will go end now. Talk. What's that special thing you love about Josh? That is unpredictable. You don't know the part of Josh you expect to see. And Josh is everything. And Josh is that boy presidential sit there. I am nobody to everybody. I'll be somebody. So Josh is that person. Josh is everything, nothing, and everything. Think about it. <laughs> Sense. <laughs> All right, so what are you looking forward to tonight? Great show. Um, this is first. Um, headlining show, so we expect to see greatness, madness on all fronts. That's what we expect to see. Yeah. Are you performing? No, I'm not performing today. So just get to have fun. Relax, yeah, just give me relax, have fun. I want to be audience. Let me feel what the audience feels. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Forever. I'm a comedian. Keep watching and you'll love Bad Moss TV. Thank you. <laughs> really threatened, I mean, height-wise, right? How are you looking up to? <laughs> how are you doing? Very well, thank you. How are you? Very well, too. So many people out here tonight, all for Josh. Why did you choose to come out? Well, you said it's all for Josh. Josh for all. Uh, we came out to support our brother, our friend, who's doing obviously very well in the industry. And um, we came to learn, we came to support, so we, came to, we came to enjoy ourselves, so, you know. So, all for Josh, Josh for all. I don't give you, I don't borrow you tagline where you go use straw today. <laughs> but for real though, are you performing tonight? Uh, well, I don't know. It depends. I'm not on his bill. But, um, you know, we could get backstage. Yeah, anything can happen, you know. All right then. Uh, how exciting does it feel for you to know that gradually those people they used to call Instagram comedian are now having their own shows? Anyways, this is very simple. <laughs> uh, Instagram comedian was initially a tag you know, for people that use Instagram as the platform, not knowing that um, it is a platform, just like the stage, the regular stage. And um, guess what? Those that tag them, Instagram comedians, are the ones coming to meet them to ask them, oh, how do you do this? Who wants to do this? Because we are moving. Uh, there's, there's a gradual movement. There's an obvious movement from um, terrestrial to, uh, what's it called? Uh, what's the word now? From terrestrial to satellites you know so people are gradually moving so trust me it's not like instagram comedian no more we have comedians that uses or the comedians that use uh different platforms they use the uh instagram they use social media platform you understand so no more instagram comedians no more and i'm glad about it because 
by that you are not limited to as to how many as to the kind of audience you can reach out to you know even if you don't have enough followers you can sponsor ads you can do all of that so there's obvious progress uh, and um, in summary it, it, it makes you not limited that's it big big shout out to Anila Badmus thank you for always supporting the brand love you eh, funny tale oh, don't break the mother of my child If you missed the show, then you should say thank you to us for bringing you all the fun and showing you everyone who attended the Just Too Funny All of Me comedy show. And yes, it's a good way to start the year in the world of comedy. Remember to stay here on the Nola Badmos TV where we'll bring you all the entertainment and all the events happening in town. My name is Alesha Moyasarulu. I remember to stay here and tell a friend about this TV. See you next time. Bye. Enola Padmos TV Entertainment without bounds.